Ready. Um, uh, do we, can we go into a Team USA War Room to hear him play the rest of this tank? Oh, we aren't even in the server. Okay. Looks like we'll be getting our cameraman back in. I'm having to get back in the game right now. No, man, can you tell us what's going on with this tank? Uh, he's not getting anything. He's actually missing some point blanks. It looks like he won't even get one in cap. Oh, wow. Yeah, yes. all the support has gone down. He got one punch on Rochelle, it looks like. That's about it. Definitely not the tank we saw from Team France. Um, Indeed. I think they were forced to go in. I mean, they really had to just go in once because they didn't have a lot of rage on that tank. Yeah. He'd already been forced to pass once. And it looks like we have our camera back in. Um, so, yeah, you guys should be able to see the action now. Team USA actually had a very nice hit on their run back just when the tank spawned. But we did not see... Uh, but, yeah, you guys did not see that, and we did not see anything quite as good during that tank. So, Team France actually has a very nice health bonus of 550 right now. Um, very high for this map. I yeah, that is pretty good. We do have another chance for Team USA to get some points here. They do have a charge and spit along with the jockey smoke. Yeah, so, all uh, the separating SI, so this could be good. Mm hmm. I, I think it's going to be probably their best bet to go while they're still trying to come through this area, the, the exit of the pub inside there, just so they can bunch them up. But it looks like Team France going to move out. Oh, going for the pull. Not quite making it right there. Alexis is probably just going to hold good. that smoke. Other SI are set up. It looks like they could go at any time, and we do have a horde coming in. So it looks like they're going to wait for the horde to start to commit. And... Yeah, horde getting pre-chipped here a little bit. Here come the SI. Jockey leading the way, getting dead stop. Charger going in, landing onto Nick. It gets cleared pretty quickly, but still going to have some spit damage. Pull one off for a little bit of damage right there. Health bonus has been chipped down to 476, but... uh. Still a very good lead for Team France right here, about 300 points. Definitely, it's at least they brought it down about 100 points. This isn't a totally unheard of bonus, but still relatively high, I would say. Yeah, I'd have to agree with you there. Um, you know, running that tank back just uh, really put Team USA on the ropes. They had to commit once and make sure they did work with it, and you know, they just didn't get any work done with it. Yep. Let's see, do we have Mediocre War Room available again? Will you be able to go back into that, Jeff? I'll find out when I load the map. It doesn't really help if I ask him while we're not able to communicate. <laughs> Actually, uh, I'm looking at the load screen now. Apparently, Team USA did not get any damage with their tank. The tank itself did not oh, get really? any punches or anything. Yeah. Well Hmm, pretty unfortunate. It, he got a punch, but it must have been God framed because his damage did not show up on the loot screen. Oh, that's not good then. All right, it looks like we're waiting for one of the USA players to load in. Yes, we did just get Riri Monster in here. Fuzz now looking like he has a very low ping of 14. Oh, it looks like it's going up. Still pretty pretty close to the server. It'll be awfully embarrassing for him if he gets pounced. That's how I always feel when I have a low ping. <laughs> well, we do have a 3-1 setup. Hunter, Charger, Smoker, Boomer. Um, for Team USA to use here against Team France. We are waiting for one of the players to ready up. And it looks like it's going live. Dawkins is just readied. Oh, I see. They put two of the SI on top of the safe room here. Very nice thing to do during the long ready up. Um, Charger and Boomer both up there, which are two pretty good SI to put up there, I think. Yeah. This is a really good hit, actually, for this uh, first attack on this map. I feel like that Smoker is a little high up there on that roof, and he's going to have trouble getting a pull without getting cleared, but we'll have to see. Maybe he's going to be able to place it just right. He could just rotate. Nice I prefer to put him on the police car. I mean, maybe they'll just rotate him there, I'm not sure. We'll have to see. Maybe maybe he can get it at an angle where the roof protects him a bit. Or maybe the other SI are just going to get their cap at great time. 
Ellis moving out to block the van spawn right there. Charger looking like he wants to go soon. They're probably going to try to open with this pull. Coaches ghosting out up front. Um, they're probably going to commit very soon. Hunter has pre-spawn. Boom, getting popped immediately by Ellis right there. Getting a two cap here though with Smoker and Hunter. Oh, and the charge goes in and lands on Rochelle as well for 10 damage. Uh, looks like that Pounce got a pretty good amount of damage. We're seeing about 60 damage total right here, so not too bad. The, for the Smoker got a lot of scratches. That's that's quite a bit of damage considering what happened with the Boomer getting popped and everything. Oh, wow. He got 21 damage from the Smoker, I believe. Yeah, he scratched Rochelle quite a bit. Oh, so, nice not too bad considering the Boomer got popped. I think they waited a little too long to go in, especially with the Boomer. We do have a tank up right here. In the hands of Team USA, uh, dropping a spit right there as it spawns. I don't know if we're gonna go into a war room for this one, since they can kind of a sniper yet though. So if they wanted to, they could actually try to play this long. The tank is actually getting full rage right now, sitting on top of that bush. Yeah, he's taking just like a couple damage per shot. He's actually taking almost 10 damage, 12 damage per shot when he's getting hit by those pistols. But we are sending a hit in right here, it looks like. Oh, Hunter getting taken down. Charger actually getting a punch onto Ellis and a bit of a stumble. But no rocks gonna go in off of that. It was close, good distance, but uh... Yeah, this is gonna be a pass pretty soon, especially if they start pushing it. Uh, they actually don't have a hunting rifle until they go past the alleyway checkpoint. Oh wow, so. it's going to be quite late. Oh, getting a rock oh, right here. Wow. Very nice, because that tank was getting low on rage. Looks like they're going to be able to play this along and do some work with it. Jockey getting a spawn in the back. Oh, he's kind of alone right here, though. Smoker does get a separation pull. Nice boom on the coach. Oh wow, looking like a nice hit. Jockey oh, does wow. land on Ellis. Team USA doing a lot of work here. They've got a big amount of separation. A lot of smoke damage went in onto Nick right there. Tank going Lots for some rocks. This tank. Doesn't he, look like he's getting him. He hasn't taken much damage though. I mean, look at that. Not even 200. Yeah, they have still so much to do with rocks, that. I believe. Going for another rock. Not going to get it. Taking a little bit of chip right there from some Susies. And it looks like another hit is just about ready as the tank has passed. Uh, not a bad hit though if they can land this boom. But the survivor is moving forward. I think they're going to try to force the tank to commit right here. And the tank is going to do just that. Getting a nice separation between the two of them. Rushing a punch there a little bit. But it looks like he does get a punch onto Rochelle with some American long arms. Charger lands, smoker lands for a little bit. He gets that corner right there. Getting an end cap. Tank still has about 2,000 health left, but can he get to any of the other survivors? Looks, Looks like, like they're going to have him pull out. Might be a good idea at this point. I don't think he's going to get much more alone. Uh, they can maybe even still do some rocks since they don't have the sniper yet. It looks like survivors are... Yeah, force and AI. Pro Shoot it. Hey, some guns here. Yeah, that was very nice work. We are seeing a spitter with this hit, spitter, hunter, jockey, and they have AI'd the tank, they have a charger now. It looks like they're going to set up for some spawns, they probably need to get some more people on top of the bridge. But it looks like they're going to go in anyway, hunter going in for distract, landing a 7 DP, sniper taking down the spitter it looks like, and charger missing there a little bit. And that was the hit, not too bad getting that DP at least. Hitting a trash can before he dies. <laughs> mm. Too bad for that AI tank. It's just not his day. But yeah, overall a really great amount of damage, especially for that early tank. We have two people fully bleeding, and Spido has also committed his pills. And we still got the running event, which is always a great source of damage. That's true, they do have quite a bit of healing items though. Four in their hands and a 2 pillow 2 pad. setup. Pull going in on the front. Oh, Charger getting taken down very nicely. And the spit not even going to block right there. Ouch. You know, I think they uh, could have done a little bit better positioning for that. That Charger just got focused and killed so quickly. 
Yeah, I feel like they rushed the hit a little bit. That first attack on this event's pretty important, in my opinion. Yeah, it really is. It can set up, you know, it sets up the survivor's pace for the rest of the event. Now, we do see another 3-1 setup here. Jockey, Charger, Hunter could be very good. They can still get some spit damage in. Um, they just have to make sure they can land that charge. And survivors are packing up here quite a bit, so I imagine he'll be able to get something. Jockey Hunter going in, Charger coming in as well, landing the charge, looks like almost a 3 cap. Getting M2, that Jockey is in the back, but a lot of spit damage onto Ellis, along with that end cap onto Nick. A Jockey got the repents hit. too on the coach. Oh wow. <laughs> That's a, that's a lot of damage for that hit. A very nice job, and they're still working on getting Nick up right now. Alarm is off from LQ. He was holding a little bit of permanent health, but the health bonus is down to only 160 right now. Survivors taking some kind of interesting positioning here for this event, but it looks like they've sent out a bile and they are going to run through right here. Very good bile positioning. I really like that in the back. And they've actually taken the next choke. Boomer coming in. Oh, getting popped before he can make that. Charger getting taken out. Not quite landing that. Uh, getting that pounce onto Ellis, though, taking down a little bit of his permanent health. And it looks like these survivors are going to make it with about 100 health bonus. And not bad. I feel like if they hadn't popped that boomer, that could have been pretty devastating with the bio, but... Absolutely true. Yeah, I think if they had been ready for that last hit a little bit sooner, they probably could have squeezed in an extra hit and, you know, hit him inside. Might have been good. But, um, yeah, still a pretty good job getting them down to only 100, 104 health bonus or whatever it was when they got in. Yeah, and good recovery by Team France, too. It, it was looking like maybe they wouldn't make it, but, uh... They shut down those last couple of attacks. And good bio, too. Yeah, yeah, really good tactical decisions there at the end of the event. I, I liked it. Alright, and so we will see Team France. Looks like they want to put the boomer on top of the safe room, too, so we'll be waiting for them to do that. He is up there now. Looks like the rest of the SI going to come from lower on the map. Smoker actually setting up on ban. It's interesting, it's something I haven't really seen. But we'll have to see. Boomer looking like he wants to go for a very quick boom here, so maybe they're planning on pulling out of safe room with a boomer intercept or something. Oh, it looks like they want to put the charger on top of the safe room roof as well. Sort of doing the same thing you, Team USA did. Oh, but he's missed his jump, so we may be here for a while while he tries to set this up. He does get on the bush. Will he make the next jump? He does. Yeah, it looks like he's got it. Alright, so we do see Charger and Boomer on that roof. Smoker still wanting to pull from Van, and Hunter just roaming around. It looks like the Hunter is Spido. And he looks like he's gonna just be everywhere. <laughs> yeah. The smoker on the van's kind of interesting. I, I was wondering if maybe they wanted to pull the first one out and get like a multi charge, and the other ones that are stacked. But also the charger's trying to get back on the roof. I don't know if you noticed that. Oh, did he fall off? Yeah, it might be here for quite a while. <laughs> yeah, I think that could work out. Um, but the survivors just need to watch for that pull. I mean, if you sit somebody in the doorway, it's always a good idea to have somebody next to him to mouse to. And yeah, so you can usually get rid of those pulls. But we'll have to see. Maybe France can pull something off right here. The game is live now. There's a lot of commons out front here, too, so we'll probably see the survivors waiting to clear some common for a bit. I don't know. I'm nervous. I'm thinking France might actually do a lot with this hit. We'll, we'll just have to see. Yeah. Dawkins is out front clearing the commons. But it looks like they aren't sitting in the safe room door, which is a very good move. 
Dawkins a little separated from his teammates. The pole could go in at any time. Here it comes. Going for the pole. Lands it on Dawkins. Should get M2'd. Oh, Charge actually taking Dawkins up the staircase. Boomer stumbling all three of the survivors in front. Charger actually got 30 damage right here, but he was taken down. Hunter getting some nice multi-scratches. Wow, actually put him up to about 60 damage right there. I'm completely exaggerating. Yeah. Uh, pretty actually decent. almost 60 damage though, yeah. Pretty good hit. Um, I feel like the survivors needed to... They were trying to shoot the tongue off and kill that smoker. But um, it would have been nice if they just M2'd him quick so he could move out of the way. We are seeing another hit set up getting set up already. Boomer going in. Oh, he does land Tank's on the docket. And the tank is spawned indeed. Why don't we go ahead and go to a survivor war room for this? Uh, in the middle area. He's not... He's more to the left than the right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's wide left. Right. Okay. Yeah, he's wide left. Reloading. Yep, he's left. Right, he's up. He's up. Yeah, let's go now. We need the LOS. Alright. Again. So let's get somewhere you can all awesome. Rock. Rock. Oh god. That scared me. That scared me. Charger Hunter. Smoker, try cat. Pounce. Charger, you guys. Peace. Ah! Oh. I should rock, 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 rock. Yeah, rock. LOS hard right now. He didn't get a rock. Yeah, just stay on this wall back here, I don't think he can... He's close enough that we're actually doing a lot of damage. Okay, just make sure you're LOS him too. He's not looking. Okay. Rock. Rock. Let's get back out in the open, spawns up. Looks like he's coming in. Left. Five side. Oh wow, I'm lagging hard. We're loading. Pounce. Clear. Rock. He's I uh, got firm. Oh, he's in trouble. Um, I'm reloading. Go. Sorry. Ouch. I'm going down. Hit me. Alright, we're good. Just kill this tank. Oh wow, I took my pills. Dumb pills. Dead. I can't. You're be okay. I've seen a lot worse. And we're back. Wow. It looked like Team USA was doing pretty well on that tank, but Reload. Team France really did a lot of work with their commit there. Actually getting almost two in-caps right there, and they actually... Reload. Piper ended up losing a set of pills, because he tried to take it, and then he got in cap. So a very nice job by Team France. This is looking like a very even map. If they can keep the bonus on Dawkins and Alexi, though, I mean, they can, they can make it a lot closer. Mm-hmm. Or... Yeah, I think that was some interesting positioning we saw from the survivors. Uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but Dawkins and I believe... Um, I'm not really sure what the strategy for that was. Sight and rocks. But, uh, interesting, not something I'd seen a lot. And it looks like we're paused while Team USA works out some issues. Uh, yeah, another thing I might want to note about that tank. We did see Team France send a lot of their SI in from one direction, which usually isn't the best idea. Uh, but Team USA also was... They seemed like they were a little bit bunched up there, and they really needed to be spread out more when that tank came in. Yep. So. What caused most of the damage was really... Uh, when the tank was... He, the tank was almost dead. He had about 1,500 HP, and the hunter came in, and he got... He pounced somebody, and it stumbled... Uh, yeah, Piper, stumbled I believe. everyone. Yeah. I thought it stumbled two, two of the survivors, actually. I mean, so, yeah. someone else I was mean, separated behind, too. I think Riri yeah. was separated behind, and then Piper got cornered after he got stumbled. And, you know, when you get stumbled by that hunter, when everybody gets stumbled, that means you're not shooting the tank, you're not quick clearing the hunter, and at the same time, those three survivors there were actually split off from another survivor who got pulled. So it's, it's always nice to have a good spread out, uh, maybe even a surround on the tank if you're really needing to push him for damage. Because, yeah, it was almost looking like they were going to kill the tank before the SI got in. He had already had... He was already down at, like, 4,500 health before he committed. So, 
Yeah, uh, they, they it was a good effort, but you know that stumble and sticking a little too close together kind of made them lose it on that tank. We have seen Riri rejoin, and so we'll probably see the unpause fairly soon, waiting for his lerp time change to show up. And it looks like they're asking if they're ready. I don't know what BJ Razzer means. I but don't know. <laughs> they're ready though. It's going live. Alright. Team France is getting... They do have spawns now. It's a 2-2. Two -two. And somebody is glitched. Oh. I think this is the first time I've seen this in a match. I've always wondered what would happen. There he goes. <laughs> they have spec'd up to fix it. But we saw the... the the ghost did charger glitch thing. Right here. Reload. Which is always very interesting to see. Uh, Team USA gonna move through this choke point with a 3-1, no, still a 2-2, two -two, but they, they switched out that smoker for a charger, it looks like. There's a freeway. Uh, this could be a pretty good hit for this choke. I don't know if they realize that uh, their hunter is not going to be able to go through that alleyway perfectly because of some invisible walls, but he's going to go for it. Oh, hits the invisible wall, gets dead stop. Charge does land onto Coach right there, who's not really carrying any health bonus, but it looks like he's going to take a lot of damage and actually getting a boom onto Alexi. So not bad from that hit. That's all right, though, for Team USA. They can just keep feeding him pills. I mean, that's what they want. They want to keep that high bonus on Alexi and Dawkins. If they can absolutely keep that with this next attack, the first attack on the event, I think they have a really good shot of making a comeback here. Yeah, they should have enough health items to keep their bleeding players from slowing him down. Uh, going to run into a couple of adrenaline shots in this trailer. We're seeing a 3-1 no charger set up with a spitter for this first hit. And it looks like Team France is going to do it when they're coming under that first rooftop there. Survivor's moving up pretty quickly. A little bit of a split right here. And the hit is coming in. Jockey going to land and get the stumble on two there. But Smoker and Hunter both not really getting their cap. Hunter dead stop. Spit goes in. We're going to see a split right here. And the Smoker does go for that pull. Going to get cleared though. I don't know if that Smoker is going to get killed though. Going He's in for going some scratches. So Dawkins in the back right here, probably telling his team to just keep moving, which is definitely what they should be doing. They took out that hit really well. They want to run through the rest of this event. We do see a boomer up for France right now. They'll probably be trying to get this in um, just before the players get to the tower. 2-2 two -two setup. They do have a charger jockey though, so this can still do some damage. And we'll have to see. Boom going in. Oh, getting popped right there. A very nice move. Charger missing in the front. But it looks like he might get some punches onto Coach. He's not really noticing. Oh, Charger does get punches onto Ellis. Who, of course, is not carrying health bonus. So they're still doing a pretty good job mitigating damage and keeping their players alive. They should be turning off the event really quickly here. Team France appears to be neglecting to hit the health bonus. I mean, the Charger and the Jockey both went for the two survivors that don't hit anything. Absolutely true. Yeah, that Charger went for Coach and got punches onto Ellis, so... It would have been nice to see him target the health bonus a little bit more. Boomer's coming in, getting popped, though. Another looks like you said. The SIR are going to come in anyway. While a Bile has gone out, Pole does land and Jockey lands as well. And, ow, a Charger actually getting... Punches, I believe, just onto Coach and Ellis again. Maybe Godframe. Dawkins has taken some chip, though, from that pull. But they're going to run, and they're going to get to safe room before all of these spawns are up. We're going to see LQ with a spawn right now with a hunter. But he's pretty much going to have to go in alone. He's going for a DP, it looks like. I think the survivors just need to go in right now. They can get in before spawns are up, and they're going to do it. They make it in with a nice 392 health bonus. So uh, they aren't quite, they aren't taking the lead right here, but it's only a 60 point gap now. Team France up with 1,484 to Team USA's 1,424. Very close game. Yeah, definitely bring it back. This is the game I wanted to see. It didn't look very good after USA's performance on map one, but uh, yeah, they, they brought it back on map two. Up. 
And map 2, I'd say, is definitely the more difficult map, so... Looking good for USA. Yeah, I think Team France really needed to focus on the health bonus a bit more. They actually got a lot of damage in onto Coach and Ellis um, in the second half of the map, but, you know, that just wasn't worth as many points because they didn't have any permanent health. But, uh, you know, good job on the survivors to mitigate the damage to those two. Alright, we will be seeing Team France on Survivor here first. With Team USA on Infected. And it looks like we have a 3-1 setup here with Boomer. And then Charger Jockey Smoker for Team USA. An alright setup for this hit. Uh, you can really get some good separation plays. But I think usually a lot of teams would prefer a spitter here to try to get some damage off of that charge and spit. Since this is still a fairly close area, but I don't know, it can go either way. It looks like the Boomer and Smoker and Jockey are all setting up on top. Doing the low ground charge, which can be pretty good here. Um, they just have to make sure their charger doesn't get focus fired, because sometimes he has to spawn up kind of early there. Team France does have a shotgun and three Uzis again, I believe. Okay, Jockey has spawned. SIR spawning, landing a pull. Charger actually getting a charge to the front. Boomer gonna go in and oh wow, not landing. Oh, he does he get a boom on the coach. Very end. Twenty-five damage onto Nick right there. Um, yeah, Charger kind of got the cap last, and the other SI were taken out sooner. So uh, a little bit of mistiming there, but uh, uh, still a very nice hit overall. I think most teams would consider that a success to get just like a charge and a pound off of that hit. And they are just now getting some spawn set up. They do have a Hunter and a Jockey set up on the rooftop over here. And it looks like they want to go in. Hunter going in. Oh wow! Ah, oh, Almost getting the separation pull there, but the Hunter steals it. Bad Dawkins, bad. <laughs> and uh... We did only see about 10 damage there in total maybe. I feel like they kind of rushed that hit again. They, they weren't really ready for that. The smoker was so far behind, and the survivors kind of went over the bus. Yeah, they went just about as soon as they got their fourth spawn on that hit. And it almost worked out okay for them. But, uh, you know, they had some steals there. They could have been really nice. AI smoker right here as our tank comes up in the hands of Alexi. Let's go to that Team USA war room. Oh, wow, boom going in. Let's hear it. I have I know why. HR's on coach. Yeah, he sees me. Yeah, he's looking up. Guys, they're giving a perfect charge spawn over here. Where? Huh. It's right here. Huh. I'm up in two. Yeah, don't let it pass yet. I'm gonna see where the spawn is. Alright, you can go. go. I just didn't want it to, uh, to be a spitter. Let's go. Get him too. Just get damage tank. You can get out over that fence to your left. Yes. Yeah, Down. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> don't let me go. What happened? It was like a wall. I don't know. Uh, oh well. That's pretty good damage. We can God take that it. all the way back and do even better than that. So that's fine. And we're back. A good Almost got that tri cap. One and a half in caps here. Um, so pretty good job overall. Not quite the wipe though. Uh, any comments on that tank, that man? Um, I feel like to get a lot of damage there, you definitely need like a multi boom, and they didn't have that. They had the tri cap, and he just kind of rushed his punches. He couldn't really get anything, and then at the end, it looked like he couldn't decide whether or not he wanted to get out or do more damage or something. So still okay yeah. damage, but probably not what USA wanted, or he couldn't get out. Okay. Yeah, it's some hesitation or just having trouble, <laughs> trouble with uh, the ladder. Okay. He's trying was... to fast climb it and sort of falling off. It looked like. Okay. So definitely something to practice if you're having issues. But I mean, they did get an all right amount of damage. Um, two in caps, nothing to shake a stick at on Parish Three. They've still got some important choke points coming up, and it looks like they've got a pretty good setup for the sewer choke point if they wanted. And it looks like they are not, they were thinking about going for an earlier hit, but they're not going to go for that. They're going to save 
for the back half of the ladder, it looks like. Or the ending part of the ladder, the final ladder. The ladder to end all ladders. And yeah, definitely a pretty standard hit, so. And they were pre-spawning to tell the other team, please do not wait. Come, <laughs> come get us. Come at me, my brother. Also delivering fight. some traffic cones to the survivors. Always very good. Um, a good show of sportsmanship. You want to give the survivors as many traffic cones. Traffic cones. Traffic cone. It's kind of available. tough. Some tough words to say there. Yeah, it's just I have trouble. They're hard. It's a tongue twist. Oh, are they really <laughs> hiding the propane? I didn't even know you could do that. Look. <laughs> <laughs> Church and Jackie working together to get things done on the infected side here. Just, uh, yeah, some little added bonuses you can do if you're waiting for the survivors to get to this choke point. Meanwhile, Team France taking their time, getting their ammo, finally jumping into the sewer, so they'll be reaching the ladder fairly soon. Team USA still has a fairly good setup for this. They need to get into position now, though. Smoker traveling across the map. They have a Molotov on Rochelle. I'm not sure if they're going to use it or not, though. Because the tank is dead, so... That car he is pulling to is alarmed, by the way, so if he gets that pull off, it's gonna be really nice. Some baiting from the survivor team right here, but they are bleeding out on two people. I think they're taking out a horde on bottom. Yes, they are, so. They did use the Molotov. <laughs> but no, Smoker is still safe and feeling good about himself. Survivor's coming up. Wow, getting a triple a charge right charge. there. Jockey. Actually going in, the car has been shot. A lot of spit damage onto Nick as well. He might get in cap. He gets in cap by the smoker right there. Rochelle is also in cap. Taking some common infected damage. So a really nice hit right there. They got rid of all of Nick's health bonus. Just Spido sitting with, uh, you know, about 40 health right now. Looks, it looks like exactly 40 health. That was a great charge by Dawkins. The The pole actually landed on the charged person, so he couldn't uh, participate in the tricap. <laughs> <laughs> but they did get the jockey on the last player, so that worked out okay. Uh, hit coming in again as the survivors are still working on some horde. Oh, wow, managing not to set off that car alarm. Oh, Charger getting juked in the back there, too. Car alarm has gone off. Another though. one. Boom in. That's not good. Survivor's so choosing to set up even more car alarms, it looks like. Which is not actually a good idea. That does summon more and more horde, but you know, the survivors are about to get to a fairly safe location, so yeah, they don't have to worry about it. So. Nothing yeah. really, no threat. Only one pill in the ambulance, though. We do have Coach still slow. They have picked up a set of pills, so it looks like he's going to speed up. We have a 3 1 setup. Oh, good job. Jeff telling the team is all about who's black and white. <laughs> <laughs> nice job. Some classy casting going on on lpd 2 tvnet right now. But that aside, yeah, Survivor's still taking up these hordes from those extra cars they hit. So we are seeing some bleed go out right now. Um, this can be a pretty good setup. They're putting the charger in. Oh, no, that is the smoker on back. Looks like he wants to try to get that death pull. I don't imagine that's going to work. That would seems be pretty probably exciting. Be pretty cautious about it. We've seen it happen in some pretty high level. Wouldn't it be great that? to see Spido get pulled back with that health bonus? Oh, wow. Horde's still coming in. Team France probably wondering why they shot so many cars at this point. <laughs> It looks like it's about dying down, though. They're going to get ready to go. And it looks like SI actually getting some spawns blocked. Coach still up top, he, but if he gets pulled, he, he won't pull. stay up there. Looks like they're going to get the smoker popped by Coach right there. Dead stops onto that Hunter, and a little bit of jock damage onto Ellis. Taking his permanent health down a little bit. And, of course, the boom landed, so we are seeing some more horde. But it looks like... Well, we do have two slow survivors, so Team USA still has a chance to get some damage in. But it looks like Team France is going to make this map. Their health bonus is currently about 180, which is pretty low, but you know, it's hard to expect even that on these this map. It's a really tough map with the ladder ship. 
We do have... Wow, a double charge landing wow. along with a pull. This Pounce just needs to land. Pouncing Ellis in the spit. That is what they needed right there. That's a death on Rochelle. Zoe, yeah. yeah, Rochelle, uh, pardon me, has died. Ellis' permanent health is gone and in cap onto Nick as well. They could actually wipe him here if they manage to get, uh, you know, a tri cap on this last hit. They definitely Spider can. Has nine health. By the time they get spawns up again, he'll just be a scratch away from death. Another great multi charge from uh, Team USA. Yeah, very nice jobs. And it looks like Spider lost the last of his permanent. Oh, wow. The Getting a boom onto Spido. He's going to go down from comments. He does go down. Jockey just needs to land. Charger goes for punches. Takes Coach down. And that is the map. A very nice map. Wipe in those last two hits, especially by Team USA. Uh, very good handling. Yeah, very nice. They just need to make this map. I think it's going to... Personally, I think mm -hmm. it's going to come down to the tank. Uh, I think they can get past the ladder choke point without too much problem. I'd have to agree with you. Yeah, if they can get past the tank without, you know, getting more than... Uh, a man or two bleeding, they should be able to make this map, but we'll have to see. Um, Team France, you know, with their lower pings, might be able to do some more work. We'll just have to see what happens. Yeah, what do you think What do you think they'll do with the tank? Uh, do you think they'll go all the way back to the open area near the safe room, or do you think they'll fight it where France did? I think we'll probably see them fight it in the same location. It's hard to say, though. Dawkins could call something different, but that... Unless you get spawns down, that run back can be a little dangerous, and then you open yourself up to car play as well. It definitely, it's, it's really hit or miss going all the way back. But um, I feel like you won't get wiped near the trailer. Yeah, I feel like knowing Dawkins, if, if he wanted to make that decision, he'd make it intelligently and they could do it. But I'm not sure if there's a huge amount of advantage for that. I mean, then you have to take more choke points going back uh, after the tank is dead. So it could really go either way. All right, and it looks like we were waiting for some of Team USA to get something worked on or something like that. So I'm actually going to go grab a drink really quick. Uh, Nutman, do you think you can keep our spectators entertained for the next minute or two? Uh, sure. I got a couple shoutouts I think I could read. All right, I'll have fun. I'll be right back. See you later. Uh, we got a shout-out from Asian. Shout-out to Dawkins' Fever Charge. Not not sure really what that's referencing, but... Uh, um, and if you want to send shout-outs, you can just message me on Steam. Or... Could send him to Prodigy Sim, but... I don't think he... Good question, Jeff. What is a Fever Charge? I believe Dawkins said he would be a B. We have another shout out from Justin Bieber to Jeff. Shout out to Jeff cheating. I'm back. Welcome back. Well, thank you. If that was their idea of something, <laughs> I can't Dawkins explaining to us all what a fever charge is. A fever charge is apparently any charge that lands. Seems like a fairly apt name. Do you know what we're waiting on right now, Nutman? Oh, it looks like Fuzz is rejoining. Yeah, Dawkins oh, just switched his loop. We were originally waiting on Dawkins, but he came back, so actually I'm not sure what we're waiting on right now. Oh, Spider there ridding up, and the round is... We do see the same 3-1 Boomer setup. Boomer coming from on top of the safe room. Um, hopefully he's not going to get popped too quickly. Survivors have moved out. Other SI spawning in first. Very nice. Landing the pull, landing the charge, and the jockey. Oh, actually getting a triple charge off of that. Only for 20 damage, though. A very quick clears, but a lot of damage. And they've got a double boom right here that is ripping up code. A very nice hit from Team France. Yeah, not bad. It looked a lot worse than it actually ended up being. I guess the charge had some god frames. Yeah, he had god frames on the yeah. jockey, and then he got cleared very quickly. So we saw the quick clear on the charger, but the other SI just did a lot of work on the survivors as well. 
Yeah, hopefully that doesn't happen again. That could have been a lot worse. Mm -hmm. We do see a 3-1 Boomer Smoker Hunter Charger again right here, and it looks like they want to try to hit inside the house. Boom coming in. Ooh, going to get a double boom right there. Getting a separation pull. Not going to get intercepted on. Charger. Wow, sliding off of Coach right there. That's what it looks <laughs> like to me. That was very yeah. interesting. Good shutdown, though. I yeah, I think now. they only got a couple points of damage from, like, a boom rune common or something. If they push while cleaning the sword, I think they could make it the tank. Yeah, they can at least make it through the next couple choke points. Um, might be pushing it a little bit, though. They have a lot of comments here to take out. That's true. Spawns are coming up just now, too. So, it looks like they're not going to have... Going to take it slow. Very safe move. Good move. Uh, same 3-1 setup, except they've replaced a hunter with a jockey, it looks like. Looks like Boom's gonna try to go on these little shacks over here. Usually a good spot if you can get that spawn, but oh, he does get blocked. Survivor's moving out. Jockey actually landing right here. Charger landing, Tricap landing! This does not look good for Team USA. A lot of damage going in onto Rochelle. Coach taking a good amount of damage as well. Oh yeah, wow, that was, Jockey's still moving. That was some... That, I don't agree with going for the Charger. I think he should have gone for the Jockey. Absolutely, I think they... And they got a little separated there, had some bad positioning. Those two survivors out on the fence should have been okay, but they just didn't get those clears on each other. Coach is in capped right now from that jock. And the tank's going to be up pretty soon with already two survivors bleeding. Um, I wonder if Team France is going to be able to get a wipe with this tank. I don't know, Team USA really needs to mitigate the damage on this. If they can make it pass with not much more, I feel it looks like, like they they're thinking about doing that run back we were talking about, actually. Yeah. They have, spawns, do have spawns. Yeah, this could be bad. Smoker's setting up for that pullback right there. Very looks like a nice spot for that. Looks like survivors should be able to cover the pullback, but they need to be very careful. Pull lands, not getting a pullback. So it looks like the survivors have made this choke. A uh, very nice handling by them, not rushing it at all. But still cutting it close. That tank is almost there. He has lost about 50% rage. So they just need to get that sniper chip and LOS the tank pretty quickly. He isn't going for the car either, and I feel like the car is the only real large danger if you take it in this area. I mean, it's Absolutely. so wide open that if he doesn't have the, the hittable, you, you can get away with almost a no-hitter, I think. Yeah, I'd agree, definitely. And he's going to need to go for the car soon, but, you know, he's waiting out a lot of his rage right now, so they could actually LOS the tank if he does go for that. Looks like they're not going to, though. Oh, they did get a Spitter. Probably not what they want, but the tank's going to have to commit right now. Spitter goes in and gets killed. Jockey going in early right here. Hunter's still I'm not bouncing sure around. what they're doing, sending SI in first. They are sending the tank onto the sniper, though, and it looks like he's going to get that corner. Oh, wow, he getting it. juke. And now moving out, it looks like. Tank still has about 3,000 health. Going to land this rock. I don't think he got any damage from it, but he did get full rage. They just need to chip him while he goes out right here. The SI are going to have another hit before the survivors can move forward, but uh, pretty well shut down by Team USA. I feel like Team France needed to time their SI a little bit better than that. That's really unlucky they got that spitter. Nice pop by Piper. Oh wow, they did get another spitter. Very not good. Uh, AI tank going to move in here with like a thousand health. Sniper should try to take it out quickly. Looks like Dawkins working on it as well, but he's a little separated. He needs to look out, but it looks like they're going to wait and just do a regular choke point hit since they only had three SI. And they now do have four. They're probably going to try to open with this boom again, I'd imagine. But we'll have to see what they're going to do. Oh, Charger spawning up in the back. Looks like not... Wow. Some indecisive. Letting him get that... Oh, almost getting that separation jock right there. A very nice clear by their sniper, Alexi. And Survivor should be moving forward pretty quick. Did that boomer even go in? No, it looks like maybe there's a bit of miscommunication on the SI team. They all came in from back, and then they couldn't decide where to go, and the boomer didn't even go to spawn, so... Yeah, it seemed like kind of a, a wishy-washy hit right there. Uh, need to be... Just need to be so sure about what you're doing when you go in for any hit. You know, even if it's not going to work, it's usually a lot better to just go in and try it and give it everything all at once. I think the tank kind of threw them off a little bit. 
they weren't really expecting that. After that nice try cap of me, I felt like they were expecting, you know, maybe we can get a wipe here. Yeah, really. And, uh, they didn't get anything. Absolutely true. And it looks like Survivor's taking out a little bit of Horde right here. They do have two players bleeding. But we are seeing a fairly nice 2-2 setup if they can make it happen in this house right here. They have a Charger and a Hunter. Both are really nice to have with the Spitter. Oh, boom, going into the Rocket. He does get two of the Survivors. Charger gets his spawn block, though. Looks like all the SA are going to come up from the back. Will this Spitter get a spawn, though? Pounce does land. Charger gets punches. Double punches and a double charge. Oh, no. In oh the spit, gosh. everyone's in So much damage onto the Survivors. Wow. Dawkins down to just a sliver of health. Coach has gotten in cap. And Ellis and Rochelle also taking a good amount of damage as well. That's not good for you to say. I, I don't think they're going to be able to make the map anymore, but they'll, they'll still be very close, regardless. Certainly. I mean, this game was only a 60 point difference coming into this map. So as long as they can keep moving, uh, maybe get some health items, they should be alright to at least keep things in range. Hunter going in, looks like a sack actually. Oh, they are sending in some more SI. Boom from the front. Come on, pop it, survivors. There we go. <laughs> kind of a late pop right there for how early he spawned, because we had a lot of reloading going on. Still a good pop though. Lots of good pops from USA. With some encouragement from Prodigy Sim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they certainly have been getting some good boomer pops on this map. They took a couple bad booms, but uh, for the most part, they've been shutting down attacks. Both teams have been shutting down uh, a good number of attacks, I think, and they just get s screwed on a really tough attack every once in a while. Do you think they'll be able to make it past this ladder? You know, there's no charger right here. Uh, I think if I think they're gonna make it unless they get like some ladder separation, like one or two people down the ladder, split by spit. Yeah, but here comes the hit. Oh, spit landing on a pounce and jockey getting clear. Looks like their health bonus on Ellis is going to go away, and ow, a car huh. getting hit in the front right here. It Not looks good. Like Coach eating some there. spit damage, actually. Dawkins also eating spit damage. This is going to be difficult to get. A massively here. large Coach is dead. Uh, okay. it looks like this is going to be it for them. Yeah, I believe so. Maybe if the car wasn't hit, they could have gotten these pickups, but, uh... Not a good death spit to walk into. They have gotten these players up, so they have that going for them, but a tri-cap is coming in. Pull lands. Oh, pull getting taken down as the jockey lands, but Dawkins is probably going to die right here. Yeah, they. this is going to be a wipe. Wow, I did not even see that jockey land. I thought Rochelle and Ellis were right next to each other. And he is... Wow! <laughs> a nice level right there at the end. Nice Piper's going to try to solo his way through the map. Oh boy. Spitter is going to kill him with a very nice... No! Smoker got it, actually. A rocket spawned Smoker. Mm -hmm. So, another 200 points down for Team USA. Scores 2,060 to 1,792. Um, so yeah, just about a 250 point lead or so. 270, almost 300. Whatever. We yeah. still got map 4, and I believe this is going to be the final map. For our game today. I would think so. They don't play finales in Europe, and I know there's been a lot of talk in the U.S. to stop playing the Parish finale specifically. Certainly, it is a very interesting finale when you try to play competitively. And by interesting, I mean frustrating. But, um, yeah, so probably a good thing that it's gone. It just is going to make our game a little shorter. Still anyone's game, though. This isn't really a safe lead. I mean, it's certainly not. This is, I mean, this is a health bonus away. This is a wipe away. Yeah. This is just some distance away. Uh, this is a 700 point map with a total possibility of 1400 health bonus, so anything can happen. Alright, so we will see Team USA up on Infected right here with a 3-1 setup with a boomer it looks like, no hunter. 
And we are actually live. We'll probably see the survivors, Team France, clear out some comments here for a bit. Hmm. I don't know. What do you? What setup do you like on this first hit in that van? Uh, this is actually really good here with all the separating aside with the boom. Um, I don't know. It, it's really a hit or miss sort of thing. But if you have the boomer, that's really what you want. Kind of slow them down a little bit. Just make sure the boom lands is what I like. Certainly good to get a boom in this area. Um, you know, survivors have to run through these little choke points to move forward. You can get pretty common luck. Looks like some weight and baiting going on. Very good move. It looks like they've cleared out most of the commons. Uh, Boomer's gonna come in from the right over here, probably with a rocket. I feel like there's some potential for him to get popped right there, but survivors aren't really looking in his direction, so he could do this all right. They could spring this at any time. That charger's right on top of two of the survivors. And they're going in. Oh, Boomer misses that rocket, but still gets the boom. Charger just goes in for punches and gets 20 damage. Dawkins actually getting a little pull damage right there as well. Wow, that, that boomer tried to rock it out and actually got caught on the infected ladder going into that <laughs> yeah, room. That happens there, everybody. That's why he's keeping a rocket out of there. Certainly unfortunate. Yeah, he probably could have gotten a multi-boom if he had made it in there on the first try. And it looks like survivors have almost taken the the tanks up. Oh, tank is up in the hands of a Riru monster. I Why think don't we go to USA another? War. Yeah, Team USA War Room. Let's go. Char two. Yeah, we're fine for right now. Might get a spitter though, because we haven't had one. Uh, HR's not looking for you yet. We're still we're looking. Fine. He's looking at us shooting. You got enough. Go to your right a bit. You go in, push in. Go in. Yeah. yeah. Don't rush your punches. Let's go help him. <laughs> that tree. You just gave him a scary. shortcut. Good job. Well, <laughs> <laughs> just let that pass. We'll let Nick bleed out. Kill kill Don't take any shot. HR's reloading. Let's get ahead as soon as we're up. I got this guy in the garage here. Before me. All right, going right now. Ah, sure you got. Jesus, it's so impossible to get more than one person with the boom. Oh, I didn't want tank to push him. Welcome back, everyone. And that was Team USA's tank. Uh, they committed with that three cap the first time there, and it looked like the tank just really had trouble cornering anybody. Um, took a lot of damage. Actually set up a car for himself to escape, which was pretty funny to watch. But, um... Yeah, he didn't really get a whole lot with that tank. Maybe he got two punches onto Nick, and I think that's almost the extent of their damage. Yeah, that was pretty much it. <laughs> they, they're. I mean, this map's still pretty long, but they're gonna have to do a lot of work to get these survivors wiped or take down their health bonus at the very least. Definitely, they do have, they do have a good setup right here with Charger, Hunter, Smoker, but um, they really need to land this charge and spit. Hope to see. Team France really taking it safe right here. Sniper in the back. Um, he's probably going to get pulled. Looks like the hit could go in at any time. Here it comes. Pull, not going to land. Charger getting some punches. Actually landing a charge. Oh, I believe that spitter got mouse too. Did spit disappearing? Yeah, that's what it looks like. But still got some nice damage onto Nick. But yeah, that, that pull getting juked right there at the start was not good. And then, yeah, without that spit, they didn't really get the full extent of what they could have. Yeah, they're gonna need some really amazing attacks on this event if they if they plan on uh, being able to win this match. It's certainly still possible, and they do have um, some good mobile SI right now. I hope they hit soon. Actually, looks like the smoker looking for a pull down. He's not quite gonna be able to get, but the SIR coming in. Oh, pull does land. 
Charger does land, getting a really nice separation play here. It looks like... Oh, wow, actually getting that charge, wow. the pull cleared. Yeah, that's a nice see how that happened. Must have, been, uh, must have been fuzz on that sniper. Um, some okay damage, though. I thought that was going to be a lot more, but it looks like Severus did a really nice job clearing that out quickly. Um, the charger clear was certainly done in a very quick manner. And Jockey, Hunter, Spitter, and waiting for one spawn right now. The survivors are pushing forward here, which a lot of teams like to do. It's very safe after a tank. Um, you can move up to any number of rooms that make it really easy to take out this event. And it looks like they are going to sit here at the top of the staircase, which is a very nice spot. I know I've used this even if there is a later tank spawn. Sometimes it's just worth risking it. And it's it looks like it, USA though. is going to try to come in or maybe lose a hunter. No, they are coming in right now. Charger not going to land that charge. Getting some punches, though. And Jockey and Spitter coming in. Maybe Coach going to take a little bit of spit. But no. It looks like the survivors, yep, taking out hits nicely in this room. And actually going to choose to push forward with that hit down. Uh, try to go get some extra ammo. And peels. And maybe keep moving through the map, too. I don't know. There is still Horde moving in. Uh, they have moved out to the street, so it looks like USA is probably going to have another hit soon. They need to get spawns for their SI quickly. Boomy's probably going to try to rock it out. Yeah, and he goes for the rocket. Oh, getting caught on oh, another no. infected ladder. Looks like pull has been cleared. Hunter getting skeeted right there by Spido. Very yeah, nice. A little skeet. ground skeet. What was that called? A Griffin skeet? I don't know. It looked nice. I was in third person, so it looked like a real skeet to me, but I guess that was. Oh, I don't know. It looked like I thought it was a ground skeet. Maybe it wasn't. And so the survivors just have to make it out of this choke point. It looks like they're going to do that before SI gets spawns. And then it's just a short run to the safe room to get yeah. claim their 752 health bonus. There's really no way to get good damage here. I mean. This is and here they come for their last ditch effort. Oh, actually landing a charge and spit on Rochelle. Wow. Getting a pull as well. I don't think we got the jockey in there, but Rochelle's going to lose quite a bit of health. Took down the health bonus. Actually almost 200 points. That was very nice. Right after I said you can't really get good damage there. <laughs> no way to get damage here. Yeah. 200 points of damage goes in onto the survivors. We made that by the skin of our teeth. CGFB Nations Cup matches, wherein we routinely make Nutman eat his word. No. Just Josh and ya. Uh, but that was a very nice job by Team France. They took out that tank and uh, made very good decisions throughout the rest of the map. Yeah. Got that 550 health bonus. Team USA can still make it on top of this, but they really, they'd have to absolutely ace the tank and just make the same good decisions during event. They'd have to be playing. I don't know. I think they'd have to be basically ace everything at this point. That's that's a pretty. That's yeah, a pretty good bonus. Like a. Thing. So um, maybe they can at least. I have pretty much all of the casters on my spectator hud right now, so I'm going to try to get that fixed. <laughs> Oh boy, it fixed nothing. <laughs> yep. Oh, well, I'm gonna really. just try to live with it for now. I've just been looking at the Confogal Spectator. Oh, I got Goliath off, now I just need to get Jeff off. I always have trouble getting Jeff off of my HUD. But anyway, the survivors... Looks like we're waiting for some of them to ready up. Not really sure. No, we're just waiting on a couple of the France players, and they are ready now. We have a 3-1 setup with Boomer. Looks like a very similar setup they're going for, and they're going to try to rocket this Boomer in from the right again. Maybe they'll have a little bit of better luck with it. Charger and Smoker are on top of a rooftop on the left, and Jockey from the front, which could be good for uh, getting another direction in with their SI. 
if he lands his boom by himself, this could be very bad. Indeed. 